we won't be going forward with filming the show anymore. At this point, it appears that the Kardashians' renaissance is over because other celebrities have grown tired of them and refuse to include them in their cycles. Despite their fame, the Kardashians are being ghosted by other celebrities who don't want anything to do with them. On live television, Reese Witherspoon not only dismisses them, but actively criticizes them. I get it, girls. It's cool to be a bad girl, she remarked. But there are ways to succeed in Hollywood without appearing on a reality TV program. When I initially started, people would be humiliated if they produced a tape and would hide it under their beds. This was meant for Kim Kardashian because of her famous sex tape. Even though the actress has previously been friendly to the girls, Rebel Wilson has confessed that she has had it with the famous family and does not respect their talents or reality TV programs. It's not that you despise any of them personally, but everything they stand for is in opposition to everything I stand for. They are not well-renowned for their talent, and I worked very hard to get where I am now, she said in an interview with Kylie and Jackie O. Belisario. A different famous person who has expressed her hate for the Kardashians said that while she despises Taylor Swift, she would prefer to interact with her than the Kardashians. Oh God, I have such an aversion to the Kardashians because I don't understand people's obsession with them. The Pretty Little Liar star said this in a 2016 interview. I refuse to accept them as our closest equivalent to the royal family. You can't talk about funny women without mentioning Amy Schumer. The October 2015 episode of Saturday Night Live that Schumer presided over. Even though she was a fan of reality TV personalities and admired Chloe, she called out the Kardashian sisters in her jokes. She claimed that, while like them, she was unable to deal with them because of the young girl's excessive beauty standards. Chloe, who we adore, has shed half of her body weight. Is it encouraging for young girls to see a whole family of women who treat the faces they were born with as if they were a simple suggestion? Kendall Jenner and I have nothing in common. The famous, when asked about Kim during the interview, the actor rolled his eyes and stated, ridiculous people with zero talent. Despite the fact that Jeremy Arena never participates in Hollywood scandals and rumors, People who are foolish enough to spend their days ensuring that everyone is aware of who they are. My spouse constantly quotes, in an interview with Lie UK, the madman Lothario John Hamm stated that he doesn't care about today's stars, including Paris Hilton, Kim Kardashian, or anyone else whose foolishness is suddenly celebrated. Curiosity has become fashionable. Even when it is celebrated, it makes no sense to me. Barack Obama is one person we didn't expect to criticize reality TV stars, but he did when talking about the effects of social media. He couldn't help but bring up the Kardashians. We weren't supposed to have these things, just like kids today didn't get a glimpse into the lives of the rich and famous. So I don't think people went around saying to themselves, I need to have a 10,000 square foot house. This is the new American dream. Kids weren't watching what Kim Kardashian wore or where Kanye West went on vacation every day thinking that it was a sign of success. Bob shocked the audience by declaring, Michael Babu is just over the stars, and he was reluctant to use them during one of his 2011 New York gigs. Ladies and gentlemen, please allow me to introduce Kim Kardashian. Before anyone could answer, he said, just joking with you, this isn't coming on my stage. Just joking. This isn't going to happen on my stage. Feeling Good by Nina Simone Chris Humphreys, Kim's ex-husband, is another famous person who is tired of their famous family and does not want anything to do with them. He accused Kim of lying after their marriage lasted only 72 days, saying the wedding was only a publicity stunt for her TV show. Humphreys and Kim's divorce did not become legal until 2013. Two years later, Kim filed a lawsuit and the irate beer seller sold her engagement ring at auction for the tidy sum of 794 US dollars. Amelia Rose. Before their relationship, Kenny Westex accused both West and Kardashian of cheating on their respective partners. But at the time, the reality TV star was dating NFL player Reggie Bush. She says the skim she found used to send pictures of herself too. Kenny, although none of this has been confirmed, I want to thank Amber for being a homewrecker, because without her, I would not have admitted Wiz Khalifa. 
and I wouldn't be as happy as I am right now. We all know that the Kardashian sisters adore snatching other women's men, as long as they believe that the man will help them achieve their desired level of popularity. I'm not surprised that they handled Blakaina and other people the same way, even though Kim was presumably Amber Rose's friend. Jonah Hill has long questioned why the Kardashians are famous despite having little to contribute. He told the Huffington Post that it's horrible that the Kardashians are more well-liked than shows like Mad Men. It's a genuinely disgusting feature of our civilization. The well-known professional singer Cena O'Connor has been caught on camera multiple times trash-talking the famous family. After viewing Kim Kardashian's Rolling Stone cover, which she put on Facebook, I was like, what the hell is this doing on the cover of Rolling Stone? Music has officially died, and who knew it would be Rolling Stone that did it? Candace Owens called him out, saying that she couldn't stand how immoral the Kardashians were, and that a mother sat down and chose to sell her daughter's body for fame and money which was successful before the tape was made public. Ray J alleged that Kris Jenner saw three recordings that her daughter had filmed with him and selected the one that, in her opinion, made her appear the best. Both the mother and the daughter, however, rejected the claims. Dinner was reprimanded by Owen for reportedly observing various stages of their daughter's makeout session with her boyfriend, despite people's advice not to. Bethany Franco applauded Kim Kardashian's skincare line and expressed her pride in doing so. In a TikTok video, Bethany criticizes the Kardashian skincare line as being unrealistic and relatively expensive. She referred to the eye cream's egg-shaped package as Babylon. I don't get it because it doesn't stack, he continues, adding that since it doesn't even have a flat bottom and is instead shaped like an egg, only billionaires can utilize this product. Franco continued, It's just not practical to use this as a mode of transportation if you don't have a private plane. Numerous celebrities like Rihanna, Beyonce, and others are sick of the Kardashians. Some of them just lack the time to talk about them, but their behaviors make it plain that they are unable to keep them in their inner circle. All I can say is that they are no longer relevant to their peers or their fans at this point. If you take a look at the reasons that most celebrities have given for not wanting to be associated with a famous family, 